Janey. I'm sorry, boy. The lab is an awful, 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 awful mess. Had a boy. Obviously, the time continuum has been disrupted, creating this new temporal event sequence resulting in this alternate reality. English, Doc. Here, here, here. Let me, let me illustrate. Imagine that this line represents time. Here's the present, 1985, the future, and the past. Prior to this point in time, somewhere in the past, the timeline skewed into this tangent, creating an alternate 1985. Alternate to you, me, and Einstein, but reality for everyone else. Recognize this? It's the bag the sports book came in. I know, because the receipt was still inside. I found them in the time machine. Along with this. It's the top of Biff's cane. I mean, old Biff from the future. Correct. It was in the time machine because Biff was in the time machine with the sports almanac. Holy shit. You see, while we were in the future, Biff got the sports book, stole the time machine, went back in time, and gave the book to himself at some point in the past. Look. <laughs> it says right here that Biff made his first million betting on a horse race in 1958. He wasn't just lucky. He knew because he had all the race results in the sports almanac. That's how he made his entire fortune. Look in his pocket with a magnifying glass. The almanac. Son of a bitch stole my idea. He must have been listening when I... It's my fault. The whole thing is my fault. If I hadn't bought that damn book, none of this would have ever happened. Well, that's all in the past. You mean the future? Whatever. It demonstrates precisely how time travel can be misused and why the time machine must be destroyed after we straighten all of this out. Right, so we go back to the future and we stop Biff from stealing the time machine. We can't, because if we travel into the future from this point in time, it will be the future of this reality in which Biff is corrupt and powerful and married to your mother and in which this has happened to me. No. Our only chance to repair the present is in the past, at the point where the timeline skewed into this tangent. In order to put the universe back as we remember it and get back to our reality, we have to find out the exact date and the specific circumstances of how, where, and when young Biff got his hands on that sports almanac. I'll ask him. <laughs>